Salim Durrani has 75 test wickets in 29 matches. Amit Mishra with 76 wickets in 22 test matches. S. Rinath took 87 wickets in 27 test matches for India. Maninder Singh played 35 test matches, got 88 test wickets for India. R.G. Nadkarni played 41 test matches, got 88 test wickets. S.L. Raju played 28 test matches, got 93 test wickets. Manoj Prabhakar played 39 test matches, got 96 wickets. One Katesh Prasad with 96 wickets in 33 test matches. Irfan Pathan played only 29 test matches, got 100 wickets. P.P. Oja played 24 test matches, got 113 wickets. Dilip Joshi played 33 test matches, got 114 wickets. Subhash Gupte played 36 test matches, got 149 wickets. Ravi Shastri played 80 test matches, got 151 wickets. As when Katuragavan played 57 test matches, got 156 wickets. Jaspreet Bumrah with 159 wickets in 36 test matches so far. Vinu Mankat played 44 test matches, got 162 wickets. Umesh Yadav played 57 test matches, got 170 wickets. E.A. Prasanna played 49 test matches, got 189 wickets. Mohamed Shami played 64 test matches, got 229 wickets so far. Javagal Srinath played 67 test matches, got 236 wickets. B.S. Chandrasekhar played 58 test matches, got 242 wickets. Bishan Singh Bedi played 67 test matches, got 266 wickets. Ravindra Jadeja played 72 test matches, got 294 wickets so far. Zaheer Khan Finished his test career with 311 wickets in 92 test matches. Ishan Sharma played 105 test matches, got 311 wickets. Harbhajan Singh played 103 test matches, got 417 wickets. Alrounder Kapil Dev played 131 test matches got 434 wickets. Ravi Ashwin just played his 100 test matches, got 516 wickets so far. Number one on that list is Neil Kumble with 619 wickets in 132 test matches.